hello hello what's going on everybody look at that oh whoa. surface find awesome okay part of an old bottle this must have been freshly tilled up so i'm out here near uh weir kansas um an old uh, mining camp a lot of mining in southeast Kansas. So I'm joined here by a few buddies of mine. We're going to do some detecting. And hopefully this time I find a miner's tag. I've been desperately looking for one. So I brought my or uh, No, I didn't bring the ORX. I brought the Equinox and I brought the Legend with me today. Uh, it does look like it's going to rain later. So we started... We're starting really early this morning. Hopefully we can uh, get a few hours in before the rain comes in. So wish me luck, everybody. Hopefully I get my bucket lister today. Looking forward to it. So I'll see you on the next target. All right, guys. My first target. Decent target, anyways. Little buckle. Cool find very nice i'll take it all right let's find a coin all right guys it's not a whole lot i have been finding some uh, square nails which <laughs> that's a really good sign uh an old tool and the uh, buckle i know another buddy of mine he's found a couple indian heads a mercury and a um, uh, bag seal so they're out here large area to hit so ooh, what's this ooh, ooh, ooh. i'm gonna go ahead and dig this up so i'll be right back all right guys i got mr stewart with me i got a high conductor decided to dig it, it was jumping around a little bit i do see some roundness It is. It is. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> Bucket lister for me. Oh, baby, 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 come here. Oh, yes. You got you a miner's tag. Oh, my very first one. Oh, what a beauty. Looks like number 20. Oh, that's awesome. That's a sick find. That's what I've been looking for for years, basically. I'm so excited right now. Okay. Got my first spiner's tag. Thank Good you. Congratulations. Okay. I am so excited right now, guys. My fir very first miner's tag. Oh, boy. All right. One heck of a find right there. All right, guys. Got myself a railroad spike. An oldie, too. Very nice find. That was actually kind of deep. I'll take it. Nope, it's not. Not? It's better. Even better? I don't know better, but it's, it's good. Maybe. Maybe it ain't. I don't know. Thought that was an old soldier, but I don't even know if it's that now. I have no idea. I don't either. I thought it was a soldier at first. But I don't know. Huh. Uh, we have found toy soldiers out here and stuff. That's really cool though. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. So Mr. Stewart has a, a little dump going on right here. I see something else down there. Something green down here. He just pulled out a bottle. He also pulled out a little porcelain uh, toilet, <laughs> which I'll, I'll take pictures of it later. But yeah, I see a bunch of glass. Yeah, that's a list of more glass. All sorts of crap in there. But yeah, fully intact <laughs> bottle. Very nice. I want to say probably about eight inches, ten mm -hmm. inches. It's deeper. And you can see the where it turns colors darker right there. So it's a it's a definitely a burn pile. Very cool. All right, guys. With the legend, I got mid forties. 
I see some roundness. Well, it's really smooth. I think it's an Indian head. But I'm not entirely sure. It's really smooth though. I'll get that puppy cleaned off and take some pictures for you guys. Very nice. All right, guys. <laughs> so I turned off my machine. Um, just taking a little breather for for a minute. Um, I'm super emotional right now. So that coin I just found it, it wasn't it wasn't a Indian head penny. So we cleaned it off and. Uh, Oh, so, sorry. Anyways, we cleaned it off, and um, it was it's my very first natural seeded dime. I can't believe it. I th I want to say it's an eight eighteen eighty three eighteen eighty nine. I don't know. When I get home, I'll definitely scrub this or the proper cleaning method to, for these. It's it is burnt. Uh, I, I'm really excited. I don't know what to say. Um, it's one of those moments where you weren't expecting it. But my very first seeded dime ever. Heck, I, I, don't, I don't think I even found one in competition. My brother's only found one. Anyway, so, guys, drop this in my hand. Oh, okay, so that's two bucket listers today that um, I'm so grateful for. Uh, I gotta thank that man. Thank that man for inviting me. Two bucket listers today. All right, guys, I'm gonna get, get my machine back on and uh, try to find some more. All right, guys, this next target, high 20s for me. I think it's jewelry. I really think it's jewelry. It has design around it, There's something in the middle. And it looks like there's holes on each side, so I am going to clean that up real quick and then empty out my pouch. And probably, I don't know if I'll get back to you guys. I'll probably just, when I go over my finds later, I'll let you guys know what that was. Cool find. All right, guys, on the legend, high conductor, kind of jumped around just a little bit, got it out. I do see some roundness. And some green. Well, <laughs> I don't know. It's copper. It's not a coin. I don't think it is. Unless there's stuff around it. Very interesting. I'll get that cleaned up. Take some pictures. All right, guys, this was ringing up, oh my goodness, like high 50s, maxing out at 60. Not very deep. It's one of those old uh, telephone bells. Went on top. That's so cool. I've only found a few of these. Very nice find. Heck yeah. All right, guys, another good one. Another miner's tag. This one's all bent up. This one's basically on top. Yep, another one. Very cool. Love it. All right, guys. So Mr. Stewart and I decided to head down on this little path to the other field, but we keep hitting targets left and right. Uh, Mr. Stewart here, he's already found a Civil War related button. Um, a um, I'm not sure what it was, but it's a decorative piece. I'm thinking it's part of maybe a uniform, maybe top hat, maybe. I just found another miner's tag. It makes number four for me for today. That is awesome. Love it. But yeah, left and right, we just keep hitting targets over here on this pathway. So we're gonna keep at it. All right, guys, <clears throat> so legend. 32 33 and I think I pulled out a coin it is round but I'm not sure I'm still learning the machine what is 32 33 
And I do see some roundness. Guess we're about to find out. Man, I have no idea. It's, it's smooth. Take my pant leg a little bit. I have no idea. <laughs> I'll get it cleaned up and... Oh, no. I think I see it. I think it's an Indian. I think it is an Indian. Well, let me uh, wash it off. I'll take some pictures and, uh, and show you guys. Good find. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and end today. It's starting to sprinkle and I'm starting to get kind of hungry. What a day. What a great hunt. I had uh, two bucket listers and um, that coin that I just found that I wasn't sure about. thought it was a Indian. It was an Indian. And uh, it was my oldest coin ever so two bucket list finds and my oldest coin ever found on this permission there's a lot to hit and you know we can hit it a hundred million times and still not find everything so big thank you to mr stewart over there for inviting me over it was a great hunt beautiful beautiful hunt i would say beautiful weather but it's kind of nippy today so all right guys i'm out you have a wonderful little wednesday i'll see you next time